Heyo YouTube, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. For those who don't know me, my name is Chubbs, also go by JChubbs, and we're picking up where we left off in Monster Sanctuary. Um, if you haven't been keeping up to date with the channel, with the with this series, um, you can always go uh, to the end of this video or look for an info card that will be over in the opposite corner where you can... Um, like the info card will take you to a, either a different video on the channel or a, a playlist or something you can always find um, you can always find the beginning of the series you can always find the content and start fresh uh, when the series is finished recording I will hopefully be able to make it into just like a condensed playlist um, just for my own organization purposes and my hat is not straight and that's gonna bug me anyway let's do this it's early for me um, I just haven't been sleeping but it is early for me wait so here here's the team right now um, I haven't been receiving a lot of feedback from you guys which is fine um, but I haven't changed the team because of that so it's kinda like there was one commenter um, Lizzie I believe who mentioned that they liked the Monty the mole bear and so it's like maybe Maybe he'll come on the team at some point. Um, but as of right now, I mean, our team is... I like where our team's at. I like what we got going on. So I don't really plan on changing anything. But in the last episode, we did get some new monsters. I almost called them Mons because of Pokemon. Um, but uh, we, we've, been, we've been amassing a good collection here. So um the idea is that maybe i'll train some up or at least we'll do some evolutions at some point um but i do plan on having an episode where we go like we take a we take a pause in the story and just kind of go backtrack and catch every single monster and then see about evolving everything but that's not happening today today's episode starts with the oracle do you believe that you are ready to face the Oracle's challenge, Spectral Keeper? Law! Come forth, noble beast. Test this Keeper's spirit through combat. Noble beast? What is that? It's a dolphin with legs. Look at that. Look at that. Is that the right word? Dolphin? What is this thing? An orca? I don't, I don't know. It's, it's some kind of creature with... Wow, I do look tired. <laughs> Whoa, I'm going to zoom back so you can't look at my tire face that much. <laughs> uh, it's weak to wind. Boom, boom. And it has water attacks. So I'm going to bring Father Bayaka instead of Cinderbug. We're going to start off strong here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we show him. Yeah. Cool, let's do this. I was not expecting a champion monster, but all the same, we'll take it. In hindsight, maybe I should have led with Cinderbug and just got a burn off or something. That was a lot of damage. Alright, here, here's the play, here's the play. We're going to switch, because he just used all, a lot of magic, so I'm going to swap into Cinderbug. I'm going to use Lightning Bolt. And then go for Chilling Wind. Yeah. He's got nothing right now. Jeez, this guy hits like a truck. I'll have to watch the playback. I don't think it said his level, but... Oof. Come on, get some burns in there. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Um, okay, I'm gonna go for Lightning Bolt. We had a strong first turn, and now it's like, oh no, oh no, 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 no. It's alright, we'll keep those burns going. See, that's what I was worried about. Oh, that is so bad. That is so mean. Alright, I gotta think about this. Um, I'm gonna go for one more. Come on, give me that three. Alright, we got it, we got it, we got it, we're good. I'm gonna buff... Ooh. And then I'm gonna shield. I just think we gotta. Ooh. 
Alright, we're gonna swap. Um, I'm gonna go into Big Squish. And then... I'm gonna Barrier. Which should increase her defense. And then I'm gonna Lightning Bolt. He's almost at half. He's almost at half. I just gotta play this a little bit more defensively right now. Bite level 2. There. Don't sprout me. Oh, he has shield as well. Okay, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna start aggressive to build up that combo for the healing. Flash. Um, okay. Chilling wind. Level three. And then you, sir, you're gonna go for the restore on Kaka. Nice, okay. Nah, that's fine. That's fine too, we resist. That's fine, bro, that's fine. I ain't too worried about it. I ain't too worried about it. Alright, lightning bolt. Chilling wind, let's go. Yee. Fluff him up. Okay. Okay, we're making a recovery here. We're doing good. Still. <laughs> Who suggested this monster? It's just like, oof. We've got a, uh, we need a new monster. What can we do? He said, let's just give some legs to a fish. It's like, alright, what else are we going to do? Uh, I find that funny. Also, I forgot to turn off my AC before this, uh, thing, so... If it kicked on during this... Um, I'll try to remember to, to, to appropriately deal with that in the edit, but if I forget, I apologize. It's going to make a little bit of noise, but it does feel really good, though. It's really toasty in here for some reason. Alright, I'm going to go for the poison bomb. So now he's poisoned, and he has to fire. Don't do it. Aqua Blast level 4? I'm glad he hasn't been using that a lot, but jeez. Jeez. Alright, we did it. I wasn't worried at all. Ha <laughs> ha. Crimson, crim, crimson? Mm hmm. English. Crimson gem and leather, I think. I was paying attention. You've bested the shaman beast. Occult? Occult? Acolot? Acolot? I don't know. Acolot would. Like, get it? Like, I think that it's pronounced like Ack Hall Wood. But it sounds like a redneck being like, I call it Wood. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> you, have, you have proven your force of will as well as your bravery. I shall give you all the aid that I can, and I trust that you will use my gifts to save the sanctuary. The key lies hidden in the deepest point of the sanctuary. Once you have this key, you will know what to do. But to enter the deepest domain of the sanctuary, you will need to collect all of the sanctuary tokens that are hidden across the sanctuary. To find the sanctuary tokens, you will need to travel to the most remote corners of the sanctuary. I can give you only one of the sanctuary tokens. I know that there is another token in the Sun Palace, which lies west of Blue Caves. That is all I can tell you. Come back anytime you wish to hear these things again. Go now. The fate of the sanctuary depends on you. Can, what happens if I go forward a little bit? Yeah, I thought so. A carrot? Bro, why is there a carrot deep underground like this? Alright, I mean, we did it. We definitely did it. Um, we took care of business. We took care of business, I'll tell you that, but we took care of business. But I don't think we're done with the blue caves just yet. Or, not blue caves. Um, oh, hello. I know what to do. Yeah, go, go over there. Maybe one more. Oh, cool. Uh, but we're definitely not done yet. I know that there's that over there. <laughs> Those are some big boys. Um, oh, I can't make that jump. Hey, what's up, bro? Hey, I'll keep it chill. Beautiful leg, isn't it? Uh, yeah. I already know this, sir. We're playing at the fight. Aw, oh, we didn't make it. How am I supposed to get up there? Do I have to have a monster that can swim? 
Okay, you know what? I'm gonna put a hold on that one because I don't think we're actually supposed to go there. Um, however, we need to go back up top. And this audio seems kind of loud. I ain't gonna lie, bro. It seems kind of loud right now. But I don't feel like yelling over the thing. Alright, give me a second, guys. Give me just a second. See, we got these lovely options over here and this audio. I can click this down one. Eh, it's not as loud, but I'm still going to turn it down manually. Cool, 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 cool. Alright. So, there is an area that I definitely distinctively remember having in this biome, in this zone, that I want to go to. Yeah, we got time. We got plenty of time. Do, 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 do. Probably can't do that. Put, put. <laughs> Aw, this isn't... Um, some old games, like, you used to be able to jump through platforms. And now you just can't. Now you just can't. Ain't the same. Ain't the same. Anyway, this is where we need to go. I don't know what's up here. I have no recollection. <laughs> You're kidding, right? Oh, okay. 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 What's with the box? You guys see that? Obtain the leather. Do you see that right there? Mysterious little box. Oh, I bet you I could make that. Come on now. I bet you I could do it. Ah, oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. He. Ah, poopy. I wanted it. I wanted it. Um, alright, let me pull up the map then. Because. That was the only other area. It was like, oh, you just go vertical and you get to the other area. I don't remember how I did that the first time, though, to be honest. Um, I see one other area. It's like right here. I have no idea why we didn't keep going that direction. Because that's probably... Hmm. Let's go check that real quick. If not, though, then I guess we'll do what she said and go to the Sun Palace. Because that's all we got. Um, I'm guessing it's going to be faster to just go back the way we came. Cool. Um, yeah, then I guess we go this way. We go this way. And what monster did you want from us? A grasshopper? Oh, a dodo egg. That's right. Horizon Beach. Yeah, yeah, I recall. I do love her sprite for some reason. It's just... It is nice. What can I say? What can I say? It is a nice, nice design. I like it. I like it a lot. Um... Okay, okay. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I have got song after song after song stuck in my head. And I can't sing anything. Because I don't want to get a copyright strike. I don't want it. Alright, here we are. So what's at the bottom? Oh, this is that spot where we had to swim and we couldn't do it because... The Sun Palace. I knew it. Okay. Okay. <gasps> Welcome, Spectral Keeper. I assume that it is your first time in the Sun Palace. What you see before you is a perfectly organized, self-maintaining biotope. When the monster sanctuary was created, each of the four spectral familiars contributed to the sanctuary in a different way. The power of the wolf created the forest and the mountains. The power of the toad created all the bodies of water. The power of the lion created the stronghold and all the other stone buildings of the sanctuary. Lastly, we come to the eagle's contribution, a miniature sun that grants light and warmth to the sun palace. It's suspended at the top of the Sun Palace. Most Keepers don't know, however, that the miniature Sun's purposes go even further. The Sun Palace is meant to be a place of balance, an underground temple filled with sunlight. An entire world that is in peace with itself, an ideal to strive toward within the Sanctuary as well as within yourself. 
but it is in danger. The sun's light has been behaving strangely, and I believe that someone's been tampering with it. If the balance of the sun's palace is destroyed, the entire sanctuary could be plagued with catastrophes like floods, storms, and earthquakes. I hope you, as a spectral keeper, understand the severity and urgency of the situation. Meet me in the center of the sun palace to save the eagle sun. Any thoughts on this? No? You just gonna be quiet? Alright, come on. He's just probably like, I don't remember, boy. Hello. Amori? Weak to Earth. So we got Brodor, we got Big Squish. And they have fire and water. Ooh, we got two guys weak to. Ooh. Um. Well, this is gonna be weird. <laughs> this is gonna be weird. Uh, I guess I'm gonna bring Cinderbug. And I'm just gonna go with Ignite level 3 on the guy in the back to try to get a burn. Okay. I mean, it's better than nothing, I'll tell you that. It's better than nothing. Uh, poison Bomb on the one in the middle. And then maybe... Gosh, I keep clicking the wrong buttons here. Earth uh, earthquake. Yeah, it's gonna do big damage. Might as well. Fiery stabs. Ouch, 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 ouch. That's a really nice sound effect, though. That's really clean. Wow. We might be outclassed here, folks. We might be outclassed here. Oh, no. Alright, I'm going to go for the burn on this one. Alright, we got we got two. We got two. I'll take it. Um, I'm going to restore Brodor. And then I'm going to... Yeah, Leaf Slash is going to do more. I'm going to go for Leaf Slash. Alright, that's one. That's one. Alright, Ice Spears. Random. Alright, we're still in it. We're still in this. I thought we'd be in bigger trouble by now. Uh, I'm going to go for Ignite on the one in the front. Okay, he got, he got tickled. He got tickled. Poison Bomb on the one in the front. Nice. And then Leaf Slash on the one in the front. Gotta get rid of that one buff. Oh, it didn't go off. Uh-oh. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Alright, there goes, uh... There goes our bug. There goes Cinder Bug. A 2v2. A Motley Crow. Cr 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 motley Crew they were. Just the two of them standing side by side heroically. Waiting for their demise. Fighting to the bitter end. Brodor and... What's his name? Brodor and Big... Big... Big Slug? Big Gummy? I don't remember. I don't remember his name. I'm sorry. Alright, I gotta go for it. Yo! We did it. All we got was leather. I mean, that's okay, though. Because we got some skills. We're leveling up. Big Squish. Big Squish. Um, every attack triggers an additional hit equal to 5% of max health. Could be okay. Eons? Aeons? The start of your turn, heal 3% of this monster's max HP for every age stack capped at 7. Interesting. Preemptive shield at the start of combat. Hey, I like the preemptive shield. Cinderbug. Lava Rush? Physical damage fire ignores 50% of the target's defense. Wow. Damage if it has a burn. What is this though? Charge destruction for every 12 charge stacks with by an ally. Um, hmm. Fuel. Whenever an enemy takes burn damage, each monster in your party gets a charge stack. Yo. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. Primal Rage? Brodor? Increase the damage dealt by 5% and additional 5% for every age stack. Okay, okay. Not crazy, not crazy. What about like... Where's Earthquake? I don't see it. Oh, right there. Can we go Earthquake level 2? Alright, I'm going to do Earthquake level 2. I think that hitting hard is going to be important. Berserk. If a single hit deals more than 25% of the enemy's max HP, 10% against champions, gain 8 charge stacks. Wow. Wow. Um. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. 
Because, like, I don't use Feather Storm because we got... Oh, but then there's the Solar Burst. Alright, I'm going to buy this just so we can unlock Solar Burst. Because I think Solar Burst would be fantastic. Fantastic. In between episodes as well, I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to uh, mess with the equipment and stuff. Oh, those guys are creepy. Not thank you. Not thank you. Ah, uh, you know what? For the content. For the content! Weak to earth, weak to earth. They're all weak to earth. Um, I guess Brodor and Big Squish, and then... They have... Well, the, the Blade Widow has earth attacks. And wind attacks. So, Cold Stone's out of the question. Could potentially bring Kaka. But Kaka doesn't have any, like, attack backs. That's why I'm like, I want to go for these, um... I want to get the elemental damage going. See, he just took burn two. So it's like, that. that's probably what we need to go for here. Poison Bomb. Nice. And then you, my friend, are going to do shielding leaves on the guy in the middle. Because he's the biggest threat right now. That's exactly why. That's so much damage. Long slash. Ouch. Alright, let's do the ignite on the one in the front. And then I'm gonna go for a restore on himself. Big Squish gotta heal himself a little bit here. And then I'm gonna take out the one in the middle. Take out the one in the middle. Coffee. Fantastic, dude. Coffee is just... Mm. Which reminds me, once I have, like... For those who don't know, like, I just... I recently graduated college, so, like... Don't have... Don't... <laughs> excuse me. Um... That career type job isn't lined up yet. Uh, until I find it, I've just been doing this in my meantime. And, uh, yeah. Um, once, once I get some money accumulated, like, goods, like, I have money to just, like, flourishly spend on myself, you know, spoil myself, I'm gonna try out, uh, Jack Septiguy's coffee. That top of the morning coffee. This, this video is not sponsored by Jack Septiguy. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I love coffee so much, and, like, I, I'm a fan of his as well, so it's like, I see all the time that he has the coffee. Hey, we got a Blade Widow egg. Yo, let's do it. Um, so yeah, want to try that coffee, for sure. Actually, for those of, uh, those of you who watch these videos that are coffee drinkers, what's your favorite coffee? Is there a certain one that maybe I haven't tried that you think I should try? Let me know. I know at least... I know there's a couple brands out there that I haven't tried um, at all, but uh, yeah, let me know. I'm excited. I love coffee. Like, I'll try any coffee. Um, okay, so we have... I'm trying to see the recording. Okay. Um, let's name this Blade Widow. Let's name it... Hmm. 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 Let's name this guy... Oh, because, I mean, it's like a praying mantis, so I was going to try to think of something. Um, oh, goodness, I can't think of the name right now. Crap. How about then we just go with... Poopy. Poopy diaper. Uh, no, it's not what we're not naming it that. Um, how about for right now, we just call him... I mean, I like the name Blade, but I don't just want to call it Blade. How about, um, let's call it Reaper. I like the name of Reaper. I just want to take a look at it real quick. What level is it? Level 18. Okay, not too far behind a lot of our monsters. Um... Attack Mastery. 
There's that long slash. I feel like this thing would be really physical. Like, really physical. Bronze over brains. So this monster would gain sorcery against might instead. Interesting. Is there a point to any of this stuff? Cyclone is physical. Alright, we'll teach you Air Cycle. And then I will teach you Air Cycle too. So then we have the uh, Cyclone and that and that and stuff. So, Reaper. Uh, it's it's intriguing. It's it's definitely intriguing. Uh, Father Bayaka has a new skill point. What do I give you, Father Bayaka? What do I give you? What do I give you? Maybe the crit buff, the crit boost, and then Coldstone. Coldstone has some uh, some stuff. So how about we give Coldstone? Hmm. Shield, copy shield ability. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Well, I think that. Oh, can I get back up there or not? <laughs> Also, this area, I know I said, like, the, the Frosty Peaks was pretty, but uh, this this one might actually take the cake. This this is, like, resonating with me. The trees, the light, just the quiet, the zen. This resonates with me so much. But, um, yeah, I think that this is a good place to end it. We can explore ties and diversify more of the Sun Palace in the next episode. So, uh, yeah. I think that's a good place to wrap it up. And, uh... I'm losing my train of thought. <laughs> so I'm going to stop there. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next episode. Later, guys.